man in this game coaching these two programs and these two players in particular getting back together again. What do you think it uh, what do you think it all means Monday night? I think it's just great for women's basketball. Uh, I mean last year you saw what it did. It it really exploded. Uh, and I feel like it, it really, you know, led us to kind of where we are today. And to get to see a rematch of this magnitude with, with two, you know, great programs, two great players, two great coaches, uh, I think it's great. I think it's great for the game. I think it's great for, for fans. I think it's great for viewers. Uh, people who don't normally watch women's basketball are going to watch this game because it's a rematch and because it's, you know, Angel Reese and Caitlin Clark to them. So I think it's great. It's the old cliche, Coach Mulkey just said it a while ago, we can't stop Caitlin Clark, we can only look to contain her, or we try to contain her. That's what she did last year. She, she scored a decent amount of points, but not 40 or 45, and you won the game. Yeah, I mean, she's an amazing player. I think that, that she shows that uh, night in, night out. In games they win, she averages 31 points. In games they lose, she averages 31 points. I mean, <laughs> you can't really stop her. You you, you have to kind of limit some things that she does. Uh, but she's a great player. She, she's a, a really great player. So, I mean, we just want to execute the game plan and, and come away with a W. Uh, coach Mulkey has said that uh, Flaget has more joy in her heart than any coach, or any player I've ever coached. Uh, and, it, and a lot of fans connect with it. It's, it's not manufactured. It's not artificial. It, it, it feels real, right? So what do you see out of her today? The same thing. Uh, I mean, I think you see with a lot of these players coming into, you know, college and, and playing college basketball, they, they've come up a certain way you know, with, with grassroots basketball and with AAU basketball, you see them come up and they've seen a lot of the players before them kind of handle it like a business. But I think that Flage, uh, because she had a, a more unique path, she came up and she just is really genuinely her. I think that she's really happy about playing basketball. I think she's really happy about pursuing all of her dreams. Uh, and I think it's just who she is, man. It's who she is. She really enjoys going out there playing, going out there competing. She's really hard on herself, but she's genuinely happy, you know, when she's playing. And she's genuinely happy and joyful to just kind of be around her teammates and be around this team. Uh, and it's great when you get to see all the hard work that she's put in, you know, kind of start to pay off, especially over this last month. I think it's really, really good to see it all pay off because she deserves it, because she is genuinely just really, really joyful. Good stuff. When you were playing and you go warm up, you're playing music by people that feel untouchable, they're like celebrities, you know. And when you're warming up and one of the player songs is playing, that's pretty unique, isn't it? It's very unique, but I think that's where we are in 2024. Uh, and I think that's where you are with kids like Flage. Uh, not only can she go out and, and play a great game in the Sweet 16 or in the SEC tournament, but during intros, you know, she has a brand new song that, that, that is doing really great. Uh, that she's doing a really good job of promoting that people want to hear and, and people want to play. So I think it's really unique. I, I think it's just kind of telling to where we are in 2024, you know, in kind of the NIL space where you can do all of these different things. Uh, I think it's amazing. Amadi, show me that real quick. Is this your twin? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Is this your twin? Love's all Sing it, come on. No. 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 <laughs> This is what they do to me. This is what they do to me all day. <laughs> I hate y'all. All of y'all. <laughs> right. Tell John Legend to pull up. <laughs> you play piano? No. 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 I can do the dun 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 I can't do the beginning part, but I can do dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun